I created a brand new Road to Glory account to see if we can beat Team of the Season in just 10 hours. What's the best team we can make? Can we get rank 1 in the weekend league? The nation's obviously going to be the best nation in the world. The nation that's going to win the Euros. Obviously France. Like, come on, like, do you think I'm saying England? Come on. You know what? That's not too bad, you know. Like, 84 pace to start off. Like, I can't complain. So here we picked up the most sellable kits and badges, which was the France home, the Man City away, and the Liverpool badge. So because Team Season is out, they have changed the rewards for Team of the Season. We do get a free guarantee pack, which could be fairly clutch for us. And we still get the welcome pack. We've got the 1 of 3, 8 3 plus. Rare gold, can we get someone good? Nope. Uh, the base hero, can we see a, like, maybe a Genoa? Nope. The base icon, we've got one of three base icon loans. Can we get some good? Nefed isn't too bad. One or two RTTK loans. Mertens, we'll take Mertens there. Again, not too shabby. And then a one of three super low, which is, which is obviously going to be a fan dyke. We get a team of season guarantee. Let's see who we get. Can we get one of the big people? It's German. It's centre back. It is Bissek. You know what? I will take that because Bissek is a really good card. I think it's like 400k. There is also objectives, which one of them was to pack a team season card. There will also be four other objectives, which you'll see throughout the video. This is a team we're going to take into Rivals to try and get the Champions points. And while doing that, we're going to hopefully tick off some objectives along the way. After grinding through some Rival games, we completed the Foundations SBC to then be able to actually do some SBCs. Where we completed the Team of the Season warm-up daily login upgrade to get the two 81 plus players so we've got a couple of packs from the objectives from daily play and other objectives let's see if we can get anyone good from these packs starting off not too great 80 times two still just a gold but is it a good goal it's french it's a striker it's not mpape it can't be mpape but it's Corolla Morani, and I will happily take Corolla Morani at this stage. The next few packs won as good. 80 times 10. Can we get anyone good to go into the squad? It's German. It's centre mid. Is that Tony Cruz? He's not good though, is he? Slow, but it's a double walkout. Who is the other one? This could be good. This could be decent. It's Mike. You know what? I'll take it. It's a goalkeeper. We need one. That's not bad. Good straight into the team straight into it uh the rest of it is awful but we then got this gem from objectives this is what the team looks like as we head back into rivals so we can qualify for champions Karam, go on fella boom Karam again it's always Karam. we have just qualified for the weekend league 81 times 11 can we see a team of the season we can't but can we get at least a good player brazil cam all right that dabina you know what dabina is okay i'll take dabina so walk out and she's decent for the team that we've got in the moment she probably fits right in rodrigo's good better for evo's coming up so i was going to do john mcginn but scotland players are just too much money i'm going to have 4.3k so like it was just not going to happen we've got no one in our club so i ended up not doing john again which is kind of a big letdown this 88 plus ankle hero pick is an fbc i need to do but we need much more fodder to complete it it will however tick off a objective of mine which is have a special hero card in the team the other objectives that we need to also complete by the end of the 10 hours, 14 wins in champs, 88 rated squad, and 5 special cards in the starting 11. So we bought Barella with our coins so we can complete the 86 rated squad of the FBC, which will come back to when we have more fodder. So we've got two player picks, see if we can get anyone good from the player picks, an 83 Ericsson, that anyone else we can get that might be worth it. Uh, Jota, good, good, good fodder. So with some fodder, we've just got a one off three, eight three plus team of the week to hopefully either use an FPC or using the team or Evo. Let's see 
isn't someone good. Um, I mean, all got a lot of pace. 3-3, three, 4-4, three, four, four, but hard to link. 3-4. Four, four. This guy's probably the only guy we can probably link. But this guy is better. I'm gonna take I'm gonna take the uh, the guy that's hard to link and hopefully we can link him in. Or use him as an FBC, plus he's the highest rated. So EA have just given us a team of the season welcome pack, which contains whatever these two things are and this. So I'm gonna take this because this is very big for our our RTG right now. So let's hopefully get some good players. Chief, there we go. There's our first team of the season right there. He's from Coventry. But you know what? We'll take anyone that's right, you probably get into the team next to Kiesler. Uh, base hero, can we get someone good from a base hero maybe? Not really. We'll, we'll take Steve because he's probably the most usable off the bench, at least. Base icon. Hmm. I think I'm going to take Sol Campbell. No, I'm not going to take Sol Campbell. I'm going to take Balak. Because we've got enough centre backs and Balak maybe might be off the bench as well i don't know and i've got these two whatever these two things are i do not know oh the live items that is great that is fantastic so we take weaver and the other one oh it's another 99 loan oh who do we take we'll take harland we'll take harland because of the, the the headers the meta we'll take harland um that's not bad like weaver looks like a good card bad you know what this is good we made some more progress in the Glass of Goldmaster, which is basically where we're going to get any good pack from to help the team will be from this. And a couple of other packs. Team's in a warm up. We get Fruit Tray. McGinn is getting done. And another daily play, which we needed one more to get the daily play reward. After quite a few terrible packs, three La Liga, La Liga F players. Is there anyone good in Brazil? Is a wing. Oh, it's Rodrigo, who we've already got. So I don't really know what to do here. So I set my sights on the 83 plus team of the week player pick. So we're gonna put Rodrigo into the team of the week FBC because I've seen there's an under that we could do. Now the 85 times two, come on EA. We need a big pull here. This is this is big. It's huge. It's not blue. Oh German striker. Forsberg, who is that? It's pop, you know what? It's, it's a walkout. It's a walkout. But we, that means the other guy's an 85. Yeah. I mean, it's good fodder, but I was kind of hoping for a bit more. Right. The 83 plus team of the week player pick round two. Can we get someone a little bit better? Or if not, someone I'm going to put into the FPC. You know what? Frimpong is actually not even a bad pull, but he is probably going to go into the FPC. And there we go. Frimpong is gone. Under is in and under goes straight into the team chemistry is looking very very rough with eight we're not going to weaken league just yet i also set my eyes on the team of the season warm-up cup because we need packs and this gives me some packs so we're just going to go straight through this it's mystery ball let's have a bit of fun many goals and many rage quits later so we have just completed the team of the season warm-up cup and to be honest it took us like not even that long because everyone just quit at like 2 0, 3 0. So these are the packs Premier League Prime, League One Prime, CVA, La Liga, Bundesliga, 8 times 5, 8, 8, 4 times 5. Like a lot of packs that could hopefully try and help us do that hero pick and help us complete that objective. So Premier League, Prime players, can we get some good? It's English, it's a right back. We need right backs. Ah, uh, it's James. I was kind of hoping for Walker, but you know, James might just be fodder the next couple of packs were absolutely awful but what's our luck about to change <laughs> just Koval yes walk out at least a three times three have given us Koval just one walk out though but I'm not gonna complain um, at least it's something and now the 84 times five to uh, finish off this little mini pack opening it's French. It's centre forward. That's going to be Benzema. Benzema's super high rated. So, although we're not going to have another walkout. Again, 90 rate is going to help a lot for that hero FPC. The 88 plus Encore hero player pick has finally been completed. It's going to be very much needed for the squad. And let's see 
who is it that we get? And also, big shout out to Rudy Diaz, who was amazing in the team season cup. Come on, EA, hopefully give us a striker, cheeky little striker, Brolin, Foller. I'm going to take Foller because of the play styles and the fact that, you know, A or plus is decent and he's actually got shooting play styles, but Brolin doesn't. So, honestly, not a bad replacement. The additional Foller, that means we can tick off one special hero in the objectives. So, this is the squad we're going to take into weekly playoffs. The hours are cutting down a little bit now, so we're going to probably gonna have to play the weekend league very very soon um you're probably wondering why there's no evos and i did say i can i can do evos i can do them there just isn't really any like friendly evos for like lower tier cards at the moment that doesn't cost like 100k and the issue is is like we don't really have the good enough cards yet to where to it wants using like the defensive mid evo or the attacking mid evo it just, it just seems like a little bit of a waste so i'm kind of holding off and see if we could pack someone to maybe make it not a waste we made light work of playoffs this guy goal after goal after goal after goal absolutely smoked him 8-2 by the way smoke team was on fire so with time dwindling down we have done and completed playoffs going into champs but before we get into champs we have some packs to open and some objectives to claim and see what we can pack and see if anything goes into the team we get a cast tevez from the objectives it's some good fodder for the future and you know maybe just like a good little sub for this weekend league as well so we actually got some good power we got an 86 times two an 84 times five you know and then the uh, a couple a couple of others from the uh, weekend league let's open up the three premier league players see if we can get anyone good in brazil it's center back it's gonna be tiago silva a red gold pack can we see a blue we cannot it is brazil again it's center back and it's not gonna be tiago silva but is that gonna be eden Minitao? oh it's not it's the other one and a mega pack one of two mega packs we have to open Argentina centre back. Okay, why is everything a centre back? I I'm, I'm from a South American country. And the last mega pack before we get into into the uh, two juicy packs, it is going to be um, I don't know who that is. Andrik. Yeah. Rip. So eight four times five. Can we see a blue? We cannot. It's another gold. It's going to be a Mares. Is indeed in fact a walkout at least. Is it a double walkout? It is not. It's a singular walkout. So that means the rest are below 85. And then the double walkout pack. Guaranteed a walkout. And guaranteed a blue. Brazil. CDM. That's going to be Casemiro. But what's the blue inside? Can it be someone good? It's Otamendi. And we can't. You see, the issue is we are so full at centre back. Like... Am I going to use Otamendi instead of Van Dijk? So we have an 83 plus team of the week player pick to try and help us do some FBCs. Because we need to meet players and we don't have any. But also to see if anyone can get into our team. So let's see. Is it going to be anyone decent? You know what? I'm going to take the Dov bit guy because at least, you know, you're 6 foot 1. You've got crazy heading. So we're also doing a couple of A1 plus player picks. Hansen is not too bad. Great fodder and a really good super sub. I am not going to complain about Hansen. So we have just crafted with pretty much the last of our fodder. Um, low end fodder that we have. Uh, another A3 plus player pick. Hopefully, again, try to get someone decent at least for a team week pack later down the line. Have a look. Who is it? We have Griezmann, Abamyang, and Hutchinson. Griezmann, on the other hand, with the formidable inform, we can actually upgrade him, and it does kind of make a bit more sense to go get Griezmann with that finesse shot plus play style. So Griezmann is going to be our first official evolution we're going to do. We're going to put him into the formidable inform because he gets inside the path plus, and that little pace boost is going to be nice. It's still going to be a good card regardless even with the lack of pace and he's definitely going to be in the team 
is going to help us a lot, I think, in this foot chance. So this is going to be the team we're going to take into the weekend league. This could be subject to change. Osmendi does not make the squad because of chemistry reasons. Um, using him will give us a minus two. So that's why we're using Virgil van Dijk instead of Osmendi. And yeah, we're just going to see what happens and and hopefully, you know, we got some good subs on the bench, good, some good players that if we need to switch out, we can. The aim is to try and get as high as possible. That is the aim. Simple as that. The first game, guy has a okay little team. Not too bad. Nice, Griezmann. Go on, fella. Nice, fella. Go on, fella. Nice, well played boys, well played, and that is going to be him out, let's freaking go man. Griezmann is completed, he is now 90 rated, happy days, he's been unbelievable by the way, unbelievable. I've just realised this whole time that we haven't even actually changed the, uh, the name of the club, so I think it's only fair that we do. Team of the season, RTG. And then a normal RTG abbreviation for the boys. But with Griezmann completed, that means we're going to start our new upgrade, which is going to be on Bissek. I've been so impressed with him. And the stat boost with the potential upgrades, it seems like a no-brainer to do Bissek. We have now reached 8 and 0. Oh, this team's been incredible. A couple of really, really tight close games. But we managed through it. We're doing all right. We're doing, we're doing way better than I thought. So let's see how the next 12 games go. Greasy. Guys obsessed with like dinks and crosses and stuff. I don't really know why, but it's right out for him. So whatever. The frick do I know, man? <sighs> let's throw in the serve as well like it's just like ah oh, it's not that good it's just <sighs> campaign pick let's see who it is one of four joel felix joel felix so we're gonna take felix because you know what i think he's just gonna be so good for the team five star skill moves this is where it all started to go wrong and this guy was gonna be at a total head loss one goal turned into two goals turned into three goals four and then five one race quick turned into two race quits that's two games been tough man that's really really tough like the team's hit the limit like 11 or one like we played so well to get there and i feel like we just kind of hit our limit oh uh, if it is whatever rank that is rank five whatever absolute collapse bro collapse absolute collapse we ball rank <sighs> my head's so gone oh, my head's actually so gone we finished rank five we go from 11 and 1 to 13 and 7 but we've got two champ picks maybe ea bless us i don't know not really and uh some slide will take to be fair that's not bad some slide not bad a 50k pack is tradable Anything we get in here will probably be sold off. Not if it's going to be only Pope. That is terrible. And the Ulmer pack. Again, not a blue. Centre back. Wolfsburg. Hendrik. Is it 85? The last two packs. We've got an 85 times 2 and 82 times 20. We're going to open the 85 times 2 first. A blue, finally. England CDM. Oh, it's, it's, a, it's a dupe. It's a dupe. It's a dupe. It's a tradable dupe, though. It's a tradable dupe. That's not too bad. 82 down 20. Can we get someone good to end the rest of the account on today's first 10 hours? It's going to be Osme Hen. And that is the only walkout. That is rough. Not a single other walkout from that pack. And with that, that is the 10 hours up. This is the team that we use for the most of it. 
Again, Mike was okay. Lazaro, uh, Lazari, and uh, and Rico Henry, who we did have, uh, held their own. Theo came in later on and played all right. Otamendi was shocking. Van Dijk's way better. This deck is probably one of the uh, better, better team seasons that I've used so far. He's very, very good. Under was decent, I thought. Kisra was all right. Uh, she for Chef was a lot better. better. That I actually originally thought and possibly is one of the more underrated uh, team season cards. Felix did his job when we uh, when we packed him. Uh, Griezmann was very good, and then once we hit like those 11 wins onwards, like once we hit like 10 wins onwards, like it just seemed like you know the, the pace was too much of an issue, and the cards just didn't really have the same like the same effect, the same impact as before. And follow probably one of the better cards, probably the best card with uh, this deck in the team. So how many objectives did we complete? Well, we can tick off the 88 rated squad and 5 special cards in final team. But 14 wins in champs, we fell short. We finished 4-1 on objectives. We have a lot to work on. And with the Reds in, this is the best team we could make on this account with 10 hours. Let me know. If you enjoyed the video down below and let me know any thoughts that you have like the video comment subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any future videos and I'll see you for the next one where we probably be Premier League team of the season so we'll see where this team goes in the Premier League team of the season.